Oh man, there's there's no no doubt in my mind I would select the training program 100% every time. When I graduated from college, I knew I didn't know what I liked about working as a civil engineer. It seemed like an ideal way for me to choose a, a career, and it was. The Professional Engineer Training Program is the department's premier instructional opportunity for engineering graduates. It offers an initial career path providing broad practical experience in the field of transportation engineering, leading to licensure as a professional engineer in Florida. There's nothing greater than the training program in the state. It's one of those programs that it's, you know, state recognized, nationally recognized as one of the best training programs in the country. The PE training program is a four-year program that is broken down into three different phases. The first phase is a rotation phase, which the PE trainees will rotate through about 20 plus offices statewide and participate in day-to-day -day office activities, meetings, and assignments. The main thing that attracted me to the PE training program uh, with DOT was that opportunity, really the first 18 months, year and a half of my professional career, to get exposure to different offices, to, to really learn about the overall DOT process um, and really get an understanding of each facet of, of the department. You go through four years of taking college classes. You get that, that experience in the books. You get the knowledge that you need, but you don't get the practical experience. And so it is, it's an onerous task to pick your, your career path after college in college. And so um, the opportunity of the PE training program, it allows you a year and a half, perhaps two, to actually decide exactly what you want to do. You get that real life experience doing the job and then you get to say, yeah, I think that's right for me. You don't get that opportunity in a lot of other uh, areas. A big pro is that you meet a lot of people um, as you rotate through all the departments. You get a good feel for how every, everything works together at DOT and um, you get key contacts. Following the rotational phase is the specialization phase. During this time, PE trainees will choose offices which were of utmost interest and join the office for six months to get a more in-depth experience. During this time, it is a transition from rotational assignments to more in-depth and responsible work. I had a chance to meet a lot of people from different offices. And you know, right now, currently in my position being in construction, we deal with so many of the, those different offices. You might have a project where you have structures component, where you have drainage components, and you have certain key technical questions that you might have um, that, that you're, you're gonna need assistance with. And I, you know, off the top of my head, just being in a trainee program and knowing all the different personnel from different offices, I can just you know, easily reach out to them and they'll be able to assist me with whatever questions that I have. Finally, a PE trainee will enter their senior phase. This phase is where the PE trainee chooses the office where they see themselves long-term. During this time, the trainee is integrated into an office in an available position and performs specific job duties using real-world engineering. I've been with the Florida Department of Transportation for 16 years, and I started off as a PE trainee, and shortly thereafter, I went to Structures Design for a little over six years, and then I moved down to Structures Maintenance. I really understood what the work really entailed. At the end of the program, the trainee has completed their four years of post-graduation engineering experience and is eligible to become a licensed professional engineer with completion of the professional engineer exam. To be eligible to apply for the PE trainee program, the applicant must graduate with an ABET accredited Bachelor of Engineering degree within four months of hire, pass the Fundamentals of Engineering or FE exam within 12 months of hire, and have less than two years of post-graduation engineering experience. Looking back, I would absolutely choose the Florida Department of Transportation PE trainee program. I think it gave me a great start to my career. It gave me an opportunity to decide where I wanted to go work and start my career with the, with the agency. And it also gave me enlightenment to know where I wanted to go back to school and do my master's degree so that I could bring more benefit to the department long-term. So if you're thinking about applying for the PE training program, Go for it.